Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a double boxy charm unboxing to box with it, to unbox with you. That was a lot of boxes there, so <laughs> don't keep me in a box. Nobody puts a baby in a box. All right, so we have two boxes to unbox with you guys. What I've decided to do is instead of doing like a review of the products from Neck from last month, in this video, I figured this might be more helpful if you guys just see everything in this box. And then I'll do a separate video of reviewing all the products that were in last month's boxes. So it's going to be just a video on its own of reviewing everything. That way there, if you're not really interested in that, you don't have to like watch it. Because I know some people aren't. My finger is dyed purple with the new lipstick I got in my Glam Bag X box. It's purple. Halsey's lipstick color. <laughs> so anyway, let's go ahead and get into this. So I'm going to unbox the smallest one first here. So BoxyCharm, as you guys know, is a... You can choose your way that you want it to come. You can get a monthly subscription of the regular boxy charm. You can get the deluxe, which is the boxy charm premium or lux. I don't know what order they go in. I'll be honest with you guys because it, it's confusing. <laughs> you got me confused. Okay, so this one here has little hearts on it, which is very promising. I love Valentine's. I love everything about Valentine's. So let's see what kind of pretty things we got in here pretty little things so the first thing in here is from glamoury glamoury so these look like maybe some brushes the packaging looks very kiddish not gonna lie it looks like the jelly reminds me of the jelly like shoes that we used to wear when we were kids there's jelly like shoes that would make your feet sweaty and smell terrible so here's what the brushes, not the brushes, <laughs> I'm not going to lie, they are very pretty. Let's see, let's pull them out of the package here. All right, so we've got four brushes here. There's what the tops look like, but the handles is what is steals the show. They have like, do you remember those old pens that you could get that had like, hmm, I remember somebody had like the lady who was not dressed properly. And if you put it one way, then the other way she would have clothes on and then the other way she wouldn't. So these what these remind me of. I know that's probably not the best thing that it reminds me of, but that's what it reminds me of. So these are the Glamoury Pink Luxe Glitter Eye Brush Collection. Glittery, enchanting, and fun. I agree. And these set features four essential eye brushes. Ultra soft duo synthetic bristles make blending easy and flawless. $29.95 for four brushes. Um, let's see. They feel soft. They feel really nice, actually. And then we have like a precision like eyeliner brush. And then we have two fluffy blending brushes. And then just one small, I don't know what this one is. I'm going to be honest with you. I have been doing makeup for, I don't even know how long now. And I still don't know what the name of brushes are. So we're just going to use it for whatever we use them for. Because if you're like me, I don't use brushes for their intended purpose. I use them for whatever I want to use them for. Sometimes if you get a brush set that you don't like, like maybe a Morphe collab that you don't like anymore, you might use those to do some fine detail painting in your house. Anybody do that? I mean, I didn't do that. Do you do that? Okay. The next thing in here is from Brow Bar. Brow Bar. Brow Bar. This is the Bombshell Brow Kit. So let's see what it says about this. It says the Bombshell Brow Kit is the most luxurious brow kit ever made. The golden goddess of all brow, ki brow kits. This chic, sleek, compact includes tweezers, brow pencil, two-sided spoolie with a brush, highlighter, concealer, and two shades of brow powder. All for the price of $40 if you can get that box. Okay, so what do we have here? This is the brow bar. And let's see. Oh my golly. I can't open it. Is this child proofed? What in the world? Okay. Oh wow. It does look really nice. Like it's a luxurious looking package. Not too fabby. Um, we've got two shades of brow products in here. I'm not sure that they're going to work for me, but I think that you could probably go in with a lighter hand if you do a lighter brow. I don't have a very dark brow, so I could go in with a lighter hand. That is a very fancy dancy package though. And $40, that's not bad, honestly, for a brow kit. Because brow kits like that are going to last you a long time. Because when you have, instead of like a pencil brow product, they go, you go through those like really quickly. This you can use for quite a long time. The next thing I'm in here, I'm in here. <laughs> oh my gosh. 
Next thing we have here is from Tula. This is the So Poreless Deep Exfoliating Blackhead Scrub. This sounds potentially bad for your skin. I don't know. It says got pores. Get this. Create it with powerhouse ingredients like pink salt, volcanic sand, and witch hazel. The scrub helps target blackheads and deeply purify and minimize the look of pores. So I've been watching a lot of TikTok videos on like doc a doctor who does skincare. And like, I don't think he would like this, but he might. I don't know. I don't have any blackheads though. So I wonder if you can use it just for regular. Does it say for regular? Minimize the looks of pores. So I might try it like in like a patch test area, but I'm not super duper excited about this. This is $32. Not very excited to be honest, but whatever. You win some, you lose some. The next thing is from Ev Evio Beauty. This is the Pore Perfect Primer, a matte finish primer. I have very dark skin. I don't want matte. I don't want matte anything. So this is something I'm just going to actually put to the side for a future giveaway because I don't, I, don't, I cannot do matte primers because my skin with it being so dry, it would make me look like the Sahara Desert. So this is a no, no for me. So it's a moisturizing primer with a matte finish that will create a smooth base for your foundation and help it last all day. With everyday use, your skin will experience the benefits of great ingredients like green tea to soothe the skin and minimize the appearance of pores while reducing any redness. This is $23. So it's not a bad price for a primer. This is a full ounce. Yeah, it's an ounce. It feels like small. I don't know. But either way, I cannot use that. So I, that will be putting that to the side for somebody else. And then the last thing in here is from Tristique. Tristique. This is the eye duo, a good vibe mascara plus an eye pencil. I'm always up for a good mascara because like I love mascaras. Oh, I've had this one before. This is the one with the built in like lash curler. So this is something else I'm just going to put back in the box. As you can tell from my face, I really loved it. Somebody else might love it. I just, I don't, I, I didn't, I didn't love it. So this is $44, an eye-opening duo for gorgeously defined eyes. Good Vibes Mascara is the first mascara to combine an eyelash curler and mascara all in one. The eye pencil formulated for sensitive eyes features a luxurious, versatile gel formula. This pencil glides on like a liquid, but provides pencil precision. Okay, so we have two things that I'm gonna be using for future giveaways. The one thing I'm not super excited about, the brow kit, it looks promising. The brushes are really cute. So the one thing that I'm really excited about in this is the brushes. Everything else is, is just mediocre in my opinion. So this box is not their best one. Not so good there, Boxy. I don't know what you were doing. Maybe you were slacking on the job. Okay, so now we're opening our next box here. So hopefully this one's a lot better. Let's see, I left this open. <laughs> Let's see. All right. What do we got here? We have the BoxyCharm Premium. So Lux is the best one, right? Or not the best, but it's like the most expensive. So we have Premium. So it goes from BoxyCharm to Boxy Premium to Boxy Lux. Will you sit still? I mean, come on, Box. This box is wanting to... Okay, it's in the way anyway. So let's flip it this way. So now it's not going to be in the camera view. Better? Better. All right. We have a card here. So we're going to read off the information about everything we get out of this box here. Ooh, I see something very exciting. So we have something from Elemis. This is the Muscle Ease Active Body Oil. Let me see what it says about you. It says, a fast absorbing body oil that contains a powerful synergy of extracts to help relax and ease tension of tired muscles. Infused with marine, maritime, maritime, maritime pine, Sea buckthorn, sea fennel, and rosemary essential oils. It envelops you in a calming, uplifting fragrance while softening and soothing the skin. $63.50. This is expensive. So, but Elemis is very expensive. Elemis is one of my favorite skincare brands, so I am very excited about this. These things are really hard to open though. Oh, wait, you know what? I forgot. These open by just the little twisty top here. So just the little twisty top is all you need to open. And then you put a little bit of this on and let's see what it smells like. Um, it definitely has like a eucalyptus scent. I think that's eucalyptus that I'm smelling here. 
I'm pretty sure it is because it smells like I have some bath like shower spray you put so like it opens you up when you put it in your shower I got it from Florida like a couple years ago and it still works great so I still use it when I'm feeling a little bit stuffy so it smells very soothing actually oh I actually really like this so I'm excited about this so this is perfect for those days that you work out and you just need something to rub over your body to make you feel good I probably wouldn't put it in maybe your personal areas maybe but like your arms your calf muscles and things like that it would be great for so I'm sure they have some warnings on here so we'll make sure we read those as well the next thing in here is from Rhode Isle this is the soft focus glow drops Rhode Isle is really really good skincare as well I remember I had this one it was like bee venom yeah I think it was bee venom and I was really scared to use it because I'm allergic to bees so I was like mm, this is probably not a good idea but it ended up working so i must not be allergic to bees as much as i thought anyway so but it worked great because it was like bee venom too i can't remember what it did i remember it did something really good for my skin though and but rhode Isle is another pretty expensive brand let's see it says the soft focus glow drops illuminate the complexion and achieve a lit from within glow with new soft focus glow drops the skincare makeup hybrid is the next generation wonder serum formulated with active ingredients to brighten the complexion and a gentle shimmer to instantly boost luminosity and glow Ooh, let's see i like things that make you look glowy i want to look like i'm from twilight so it's in a, a nice pink bottle here it's got the little um dropper thing it's got the dropper thing right here so let's see let's put this on the other hand because this hand's like glowing let's see what we can put over here all right oh well, let me see what we got here look kind of it's lighter than Pepto-Bismol but it kind of looks like Pepto-Bismol it smells very soothing not sure what the ingredients are that's making it smell good but it smells very soothing or is it that I don't know no it's this it smells very soothing. It feels really nice. Do I look luminous? I don't know. It looks better, that's for sure. My hands, my whole body is like extremely dry. So I am very excited about that. That is $60. So we've got some pretty expensive items in here so far. The next thing is from Bali Balm. This is a sweet orange and coconut lip balm. I love lip balms. I use lip balms all the time. So this is a sweet orange and coconut. Let's see what it smells like. Uh, let's see, let's put it, where can I put it? Let's put it here. <laughs> uh, let's put it here so we don't get it confused with anything else. Oh, it smells really good. It reminds me of, do you know those orange, um, what are they called? The Lifesavers, you can get the winter green and all the different ones. It kind of smells like the orange ones smells like that a little bit so mm, this smells good I'm excited about this this is an essential oil of sweet orange and coconut it gives this lip balm its citrusy tropical aroma and silky smooth consistency sweet orange is packed with vitamin C which is known to even skin tone and protect against free radicals coconut is a natural emollient that moisturizes for soft supple lips $33 that's a really expensive like lip balm so it better be pretty good. I mean, right here where I put it, it feels really nice. So, I mean, if we're going by like the inner part of my arm, then it's gonna be great. The next thing in here is an eyeshadow palette. We have the Huda Beauty Pastels. This is the lilac one. I didn't purchase any of her, the, the pastel color ones. I haven't purchased any of these. So I am excited to see what this looks like. I haven't purchased any of her mini ones for a while, honestly. Oh, that's pretty. She's even got that weird looking mixture of a shade there in there. So this looks really pretty. Uh, let's see what it says. It says Huda Beauty Pastel Obsessions. It says create limit, limitless look from soft, pretty glam to bold runway styles with these pigmented powered palettes containing a variation of non-dreamy mattes high shine metallics and next generation shimmer swirls $29 I think these were actually on sale recently so if you didn't get it in your box maybe you could check out I think Sephora had them on sale I'm not a huge pastel palette person I had the Kat Von D pastel palette and I ended up getting rid of it 
I just don't love pastels. I'm gonna, gonna be honest. Pastels are not my thing, but it might be pretty. I don't know. We'll try it out. The next thing we have is from Tarte. This is the Tartist Double Take Eyeliner. Oh, I really love this eyeliner. This is a really, really good eyeliner. So I'm very excited about this. This is $24. It says get the perfect wing every time with these gel and liquid partners in line. The best selling vegan dual ended eyeliner that has waterproof liquid and gel formulas will cause some serious double takes. This product is full size, made just for charmers, and is not for resale. Is not for resale. Well, how did I have this before? Because I've had this before. Did I get it in a boxy charm? I don't know, but I know I've had it. Actually, I probably have one still in my liner drawer. So I don't know. That's weird. Twenty four dollars. Okay, I'm very excited about it though. So I love it. Okay, and the the last item is from. Odacite, Odacite, Odacy, Odacy. I don't know. <laughs> I am not good with pronouncing. No. It says Blue Aurora Cleansing Water. This powerful no rinse cleanser formulated to make cleansing quick, effective, and delicious. Mm -hmm. Energized by purifying Urveda her herbs, this cleanser sweeps away dirt, makeup, and pollution in just one easy step. Specifically formulated to combat skin damaging up pollutants before they take their toll. $39. So I am super duper excited about this actually. So I am always looking for a good cleanser, especially one that takes everything off like super easy because I don't like to pull on my skin a whole lot because that's not good for your skin, especially around your eye area. So I'm excited. This is a nice glass bottle. So if you don't like this product, you might be able to keep it and use it to play a game of baseball or <laughs> something. Don't do that because it's glass. But it's very heavy. It's a very heavy bottle. So very excited about this. So let's see what our grand total is for both of these boxes. How did they do today? Let's find our handy dandy calculator, aka my phone. And let's see. Okay, what do we have here? So for the regular boxy charm, which is $25. So you pay $25 and you're going to get. $40 for the Brow Bar, $32 for the Tula, $44 for the Tristique, $29.95 for the Glamoury brushes, the ones that have the uh, this case. And then lastly, we got, what do we got here? We have the Evio Primer, so the one that was for matte. Oh, holy smokes, what in the world did I do there? My numbers were going like 16 miles long. <laughs> I don't think that's how you supposed to do somebody teach me how to use a calculator oh my golly clear 40 32 44 29.95 oops uh clear 29.95 plus uh 32 plus 23 168.95 for everything that was on our regular boxy charm not bad, but considering I only like three of the items and one of them, maybe not even. Not super excited about that box. And then, let's see, we have for the other one, which this box is, how much is this box? Is it 35 or is it 50? I don't even know anymore. I think it's 35, but I'm not sure. So let's see, we have $29 plus 63 plus 60 plus 39 plus 24 plus 33 248.50 6 is there six is that right six items so divide that by six. Oh wait no 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 hmm. so we had a big old box here you guys saw the numbers i'm losing my mind here trying to figure out things but it could be because let's see if i can show you the time yeah it's like 4 17 in the morning it's it's, it's pretty early or late because I didn't go to bed yet. So <laughs> either way, I would love to know your thoughts and opinions on these boxes. Let me know. I'm a little bit giddy now. I think I need to go to bed, wash my makeup off. I'll try this out to get my makeup off, get to bed and then try to get these uploaded for you guys. I'm going to try to upload these for you for Saturday. One of these I had just did two. I did my Ipsy. Was it Ipsy? Yeah, the Ipsy Lim Bag X. So you probably saw that one before this one. So this one will probably go up on Monday. 
Either way, I would love to know your thoughts, your opinions on these boxes. And also let me know, do you want to see a review of all the products that were in last month's boxes? If not, it's no big deal. You guys let me know how you want me to handle these videos. It's all up to you how you like to view them. Thank you guys so much for watching and until next time, I'll catch you guys later.